Hey guys, and welcome back. If you're interested in getting all of our college basketball picks for today, including our daily free play, and for today, that's going to be a pick against the spread in the matchup between Penn and Yale, you can get all of those plays over at stumpthespread.com, which is linked down in the video description. Heading into this one, I'm going to be talking about this matchup here today between UT Arlington and Texas State. Give our lean on who we feel has the better edge to cover the road team. Texas Arlington coming in as about three and a half point favorites on the air right now, the Mavericks standing 18 and 12 overall and nine and eight within the Sun Belt in comparison to their opposition, Texas State, who's been fading back in the standings over the past month of action, now sitting 14 and 16 overall and seven and 10 within conference. UT Arlington, they've been looking better over the past week of action, going on to beat two teams that currently stand above them within the Sun Belt, taking down Georgia Southern by a final of 83 to 63, and then following that up with a nice win over Georgia State by a final of 89 to 81. And these are two of the three teams that currently sit above the Mavericks within the Sun Belt standings. It hasn't been the kind of year that UT Arlington was hoping for. This is a veteran group that had high expectations coming into this season. They just haven't been able to put together consistent results. Results, but when they play up to their ceiling, certainly one of the more dangerous teams within the Sun Belt. And we feel like if UT Arlington can continue to build off of the success that they've had over the past week of action, carry that into postseason play, certainly a team to look out for come the Sun Belt postseason tournament. On the year right now, the Mavericks, they're 72nd in the nation in scoring average, 34th in assists. 18th in rebounding and 208th in total team defense. So their defensive numbers, not quite what they'd want to be, but still a positive plus minus on the year of around four and a half points. So this group, like I said, they've been showing much better results as of late, and they're going to try to carry that over into this matchup here today against Texas State. Now the Texas State Bobcats, they had a great start to Sunbelt action, but over the past month, they've gone on to lose the last eight games in a row. A number of these contests have been competitive. Every now and then they've had some convincing defeats, but this is a team that typically slows things down, grinds things into these half-court battles, and leans on their defense for success. And that means a lot of these games have been very close for Texas State with throughout league play. They've more uh, recently have had a tough time winning these very close games, whereas earlier within conference play, they were consistently picking up the wins. It'll be interesting to see if they can turn things around and try to grab a win here today after losing their last eight games in a row. On the year right now, Texas State, they're 326th in the nation in scoring average compared to 20th in total team defense and a slight positive plus minus of right at around a point. When these two teams went against each other about Three weeks ago, Texas State went on the road to UT Arlington. It was a competitive matchup. They fell short at the end of the day by a final of 68 to 70. But we feel like UT Arlington is playing better ball right now than where they were at at that current point in time. And also, coming into this one today, we just feel like UT Arlington has a much higher ceiling. And Texas State, they've just been really struggling and kind of spinning their tires here with some of their more recent results, like their 27-point loss last week against Georgia State not looking very good. So we're going to go ahead side with the road team here today, taking UT Arlington to pick up their second win over Texas State within Sunbelt play as they go on to cover this manageable three and a half point spread. If you guys agree, give the video a thumbs up. If you disagree, give it a thumbs down. Check out all of our picks for today over at stumpthespread.com, which is linked down in the video description. And be sure to click that subscribe button on our YouTube channel. Thanks for stopping on in and we hope to see you guys in future videos. Bye.